So if you haven't watched the previous video on heel toe double strokes, you should check that out before continuing to this video, as this will be used as the basis for continuous strokes. So you're going to start the stroke from the hip flexor, lifting the entire leg off the pedal. Then you just drop the leg, allowing the beater to come off, raise the toe, and then hit the toe into the pedal, burying the beater. From there you're going to lift the entire leg, and then just repeat the stroke. Raise the toe, hit parallel to the pedal board, allowing the beater to come off, raise the toe, then hit down with the toe, burying the beater. Lift, 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 lift. So it's good to start with groups of four before moving on to larger groups. So let's just start with two groups of doubles played back to back together. Now a little faster. Once you have groups of four down, you can do any even number grouping. Two, four, six, eight, etc. It's just looping the same motion over and over again. The motion becomes less apparent, but it's still what I'm thinking mentally. So for odd groupings, it's basically the same as even grouping, except when you drop the leg after lifting, you bury the beater rather than letting it bounce off the head. So you're going to again lift the entire foot, drop the foot, raise the toe, press down with the toe, then lift again, only this time you're going to come down and bury the beater rather than letting it rebound. So the heel is up on the come down. After getting threes down, you can combine it with any even grouping to make any odd grouping. Three, five, seven, nine, 